In a little less than a month, the Chattanooga Convention Center will be turned into a beautiful sparkling ballroom. Dare to Dance is Saturday, October 11th, but it's more than just a Chattanooga version of Dancing with the Stars. And you're going to see one of News Channel 9's finest strutting her stuff. Ah, the coveted mirror ball, an icon in ABC's Dancing with the Stars and Chattanooga's Dare to Dance. Several people from Channel 9 have participated in Dare to Dance. Latricia has done it, Jason's done it, and um, when I mentioned it'd be fun, of course, Latricia passed my name on to Heather with the Kidney Foundation, and the rest is history. Back down from a challenge? No way. Dare to Dance is essentially a local version of Dancing with the Stars. A professional dancer is paired with a, quote, star. In Kelsey's case, her pro is Tyler Kaiser, who dances at the Fred Astaire Dance Studio in Chattanooga. The pro choreographs, then the couple perfects two dances, smooth and rhythm. I have had no ballroom training, which is what we spent majority of our time on. And learning how to waltz might look easy, but... Whew, it's all technique, and that is really hard to learn and perfect. But Dare to Dance is more than just an entertaining show. It's an enormous fundraiser for the Kidney Foundation of the Greater Chattanooga area. The foundation is an independent nonprofit organization. What executive director Heather Webster says makes it so unique. Everything that we do in this area stays local and stays right here in our 11 county service area. Each pair raises money for a different program within the foundation. For example, Kelsey's is patient enrichment. A few weeks ago, I went back to school clothes shopping with Jordan, who's 16 years old, going to high school and needed new clothes. So money from my program helped buy him a new fall wardrobe. Another program, transportation, helping patients get to and from weekly dialysis treatments. It makes the long nights and the stress of fundraising and dancing and making a routine look good, it makes it all worth it. Right now, they're in crunch mode, practicing five times a week, and of course, putting the final touches on those stunning, sparkly outfits. We've got our first dance down, and I, I think it's looking pretty good. Um, now we're still working on choreography for the second dance, which is our rhythm. Is she gone? <laughs> uh, Kelsey's been a great. She's she's a very quick learner, which makes things so much easier. And Kels, no pressure or anything. We've had some great dancers in the past, and Kelsey's one not to miss. And Dare to Dance mm -hmm. is less than a month away, and Kelsey still needs your help with donations. For more information on how to donate, just head on over to our website, newschannel9.com, and look for this story.